What do you call that, that hairstyle? Oh, that's the uh, the mullet right there. Yeah. Is there. Is there a reason you decided to go with that? Uh, me and Jamie were just chatting on FaceTime and like, shoot, April, May, and uh, just kind of came about. And we're both growing one right now, seeing who can grow the better one. Uh, Jamie and I are pretty close. We talk all the time. We hang out um, throughout the off season. And when we came up here, we came up about a month, month and a half earlier uh, before camp started. Uh, and we'd kick and punt together. And uh, we would, I'd try and push him a little bit, um, punt wise. We'd play a little directional game. Uh, he has a bigger punt leg than me, obviously. But uh, when it came to consistency and things like that, I would try my best to push him. So he got some competition out of it. Uh, and we, we enjoyed ourselves doing that. It was fun. Kicking into the dog pound end and, and, and how that's been an emphasis. And I was just wondering um, what, what, what has gone into improving uh, for you? Obviously, we saw a lot of kickers have issues down there. And, and so how, how are you kind of uh, approaching that as you get ready for your second season? Uh, going down there, just getting the reps, picking out target points um, towards the dog pound end, towards the other end are very key and vital uh, to my success. And um, other than that, you just got to go down there and hit a good ball. Um, odds are if it's windy and you don't hit a, a solid ball, it's going to be harder to make that kick. But my goal is to hit an A ball every single time. And if I do that, towards the dog pound, there won't be any issues. So that's been my goal is to go down there and keep the same technique, hit a solid ball, and just have no worries or no issues at all and just be confident in myself. I'm wondering what you think it would be like kicking without fans. I mean, I know you do it at practice, but in the game situation, do you think it will be a lot different? Do you think it will have any impact at all? Uh, I, I haven't really thought about it too much. I mean, it's going to be different, obviously, kicking in an empty stadium during a game. Um, but we're all a part of history and we're all a part of this journey. So you have to adapt and overcome everything that's thrown your way. Uh, and I, I think it'll be, it'll be interesting. It'll be weird at first, but we're going to have the crowd noise pumped in there. Um, and it's still going to be a game. So there's still going to be those pressure scenarios where you're locked in, you're ready to roll because we're trying to win games here and we're trying to get a change the culture and just continue doing what we do.